Tui, first of all, welcome to Emerald Headley Stadium. Uh, what's your first impressions? Yeah, the stadium is looking pretty good, uh, to be honest. Last time I came here, um, yeah, it was smaller, obviously, with the stands, but um, there's some good memories here, and um, yeah, I'm looking forward to, I guess, running out to the pitch as a, as a rhino. So. Yeah, last time you were here, you were with New Zealand playing against playing against Leeds in front of the old South Stand. It's changed a bit since then. Yeah, it has actually. Um, hopefully, we get more crazy fans up on their stand <laughs> for the next season. So, um, yeah, now nah, that's actually a good stand. You know, when I came, um, you know, all the singing and uh, yeah, you know, the haka. Um, yeah, I guess that, that was a great memory, and I'll never forget that. Um, so hopefully, I, uh, I get to I guess be a part of it. Um, you know playing for the Rhinos and hearing them cheer, um, it'll be good. It's a few months now since we announced you were joining Leeds. Uh, how keen are you to be, to be over here now and get, get started? Yeah, no, I'm really excited um, actually. Uh, I've been thinking about it quite a bit lately and um, you know, I guess the season was done and I got to really reflect on um, you know, the decision I, I did make and uh, you know, me and my family are really excited for this opportunity. Um, I know that we're you know, across the other world from my family but um, you know, it's a great chance for I guess myself to um, you know get back to playing some good footy. Um, you know, my goal here is to I guess win a premiership with the Rhinos. Um, you know, that, that's a goal of mindset. So um, you know, I've got three years to kind of I guess you know help our team get along to the grand final and win it. So yeah. How, how excited is teaming up with Comrade Horrell, obviously your your Tongan teammate in in Rhinos colours now. Yeah, it's going to be good. Um, when he first told me that he was coming, I said, yeah, "You're lies. You're not coming." He's like, no, I'm coming, and you know, till the till the till the day he announced it, I was I didn't believe him, and then I was like, oh wow, it's, it's good for us, you know. Um, you know. I've played against Connie, and I've played with him, and you know, what I've seen him do on the field is, is amazing. So, um, you know, it's, it's good having someone like him, I guess, in the same team as you, and and what he's capable of doing is um, you know, is amazing. So, you know, it's going to be good. Dave Ferner last year with his attacking style, working with South got uh, plenty of plaudits. Uh, is that something that excites you working with Dave? Yeah, it's going to be good, you know. Rabbitohs are one of the top teams in the air attack. Um, you know, I've worked with Frenzy also in the defensive department um, playing for Tonga, so um, I guess he's got experience in um, you know, both departments and uh, I think that's a bonus. So, you know, I'm looking forward to working with um, Frenzy a lot closer and um, you know, got a couple of weeks now to, to get close with him and um, for I guess I'll, I'll game in Boxing Day, so yeah. How much looking forward to the game on Boxing Day? Some, a new experience for you? Yeah, I, I actually can't wait for that game. You know, I, I wanted to come around quicker than it, you know, <laughs> actually is. Um, you know, just seeing the fans here, um, I guess getting a, getting a welcoming. I guess uh, um, being able to play in the Leeds Runner jersey. So um, you know, I'm looking forward to it, and I'm sure that you know, the, the boys that are coming over are looking forward to it as well. So it's going to be a great experience, and probably something I won't forget. And your last run out of course with Tonga against Australia, incredible atmosphere over in over in New Zealand. How was that experience? Yeah, it's amazing, you know. Um, it's just to reflect off the World Cup and what our what our fans were were doing and you know they turned up once again um, in full support, you know. Uh, just even the opportunity to get to play against Australia, I guess as a as a young fella, you know that Australia's always been the top team in the world and you know, just to play against them is, is a I guess is history and also, just being a part of Tonga, that, that was the first time playing against Australia, it was pretty pretty special. Um, I'm glad we didn't get the win, um, but you know, we made history and hopefully next time we play them, um, uh, it might be a win, so that'll be good. And you think with yourself and Connie and obviously Dave's connection to Tonga, Tongan fans might adopt the Rhinos for next season? Oh, well, I hope so. Um, probably too far for them to travel over, but um, yeah, I'm not surprised if uh, a couple of them supporting on TV. So, yeah. A lot of players when they come over from, from overseas talk about the weather and, and adapting that, but obviously from being from, from Auckland and spending a lot of time in New Zealand, it's pretty pretty used, used to this sort of weather. Yeah, I guess New Zealand's almost similar to this. Um, it's probably a, maybe a little bit colder, I guess you get snow in there, so you know, that's probably the one thing that was in my head <laughs> before coming over. Ah, it's going to be cold, it's going to snow, so um, you know, I guess prepared for that mentally and um, uh, it's just another, I guess, obstacle in the way uh, we're going to overcome it uh, footy-wise, so yeah.